Today, chip maker Wolf Spree, it Wolf Speed celebrated the final steel beam going up for their new factory in Chatham County. A five billion dollar project is changing the way the world powers systems like electric cars and will employ 1800 Wolf Speed workers in six years. Only on WREL, I spoke with the company's CEO about the excitement surrounding the technology and the community. You know, there's a whole valley in California named after the semiconductor industry, Silicon Valley, of course. And here in North Carolina, we're building the major, the world's largest hub for silicon carbide. And it's enabling that transition from, from you know, internal combustion engine to electric cars, better use of solar energy. Most of the electric cars on the street today or in customers in the, uh, in the um, uh, lots today are built on silicon. They were designed seven years ago before silicon carbide was really where it is today. So they have lousy range, they have lousy charging time, etc. Over the next three years, there's going to be over 120 new models with just wool speed silicon carbide in it. So customers are going to be excited about a bigger, a longer range, faster charging, and of course the vehicle costs will come down as well. How many people have you hired already for the, the facility itself, not just construction? Several hundred already, and uh, they're getting trained. A lot of the training is, is happening on the Durham campus, um, but we, we actually have employees now full-time out here as well. We're installing our first crystal growers as we speak, and we'll be energizing them in the summer, and we'll be actually producing material out of this factory probably by the December quarter, perhaps January. It's happening at a breakneck speed. In, in 18 months ago, this was a, a forest. Um, it was a, a, you know, two million cubic yards of rock that we had to blast mm -hmm. through. So it was quite a bit, big project, but um, it's amazing how fast it's going up. You've got neighbors that are going to be joining you, too, mm -hmm. with Toyota and VinFast. So does this feel like, you know, you talked about Silicon Valley in California. Does this feel like you're getting to be a hub here for EV? Absolutely. So Toyota is building the, the battery factory. VinFast is using our technology in their cars. So, you know, they're, the, the neighbors are going to be supplying each other, which is really going to be fantastic. We're very, very proud of that. Do you worry about competition of hiring enough workers? I think at this point we're pretty excited about our ability to attract people. As I mentioned, you know, we're on the cutting edge of technology. We're the, we're the new shiny thing in semiconductors. So it's, it's actually quite, um, I don't want to say easy, but it's, it's pretty straightforward for us to recruit people. A lot of it is local. Um, but we also have people coming in from Texas, from California, from various different, you know, states and uh, bringing economic development here to, to Chatham County. And you, you talked about the people here of this community. How supportive have they been? They've been terrific. You know, we we work with um, lots of local, you know, organizations. One of the uh, one of the ones I'm very fond of is Celebrity Farms. It's a goat farm right here in Siler City. Uh, it's an active goat farm, but they also do really nice dinner events. So when we have customers come in, we just stop on over to the goat farm. And I got to tell you, you know, we had a, a group of Japanese customers in, and I think it's the first goat farm they've ever been on. <laughs> so it was pretty entertaining. <laughs> A great experience in Chatham County. Wolf Speed has several outreach programs in the area, including STEM programs and schools. They sponsor a soccer team and just had a car in the Hispanic Heritage Parade.